Thank you. All the rain we're getting is putting river towns in our area on alert. Tonight, flood walls are up in Hannibal, where the Mississippi is on the rise. All eyes, though, are also on the Missouri River tonight. There is a state of emergency in place in preparation for potential flooding along that waterway in the next coming days. Besides Hannibal, the city of Clarksville is building a rock and sandbag wall to hold back the water there. Russell Kinsall is live in Kimswick tonight, where he's checking the risk of flooding here in the metro. Yeah, right now I'm standing on the deck outside the Anheuser house on the south side of Kimswick. The river is really high right now. It's right behind me. Uh, whenever it's this high, there's always a lot more debris in it. And for that reason, the Coast Guard is asking recreational boaters to stay off the river right now because uh, that debris could damage your boat. But the high river water is not expected to cause any impact on the Celebrate St. Louis event that's happening this week in downtown St. Louis. And it's not expected to cause any flooding here in Kimswick. Are you ready to order? One of the things that historic Kimswick is known for is its restaurants that customers drive many miles to visit. It's a small, quaint little town. Uh, we like the food. I had a bacon sandwich with tomato and pretzel bread. This group of ladies visited Kimswick today, not only for the food, but also the shopping. Clothes and jewelry. <laughs> The purses. And they were mindful that this river town has had to battle the rising waters of the Mississippi River over the years. Because I had a relative that lived here that got flooded out one time. This time around, Kimswick is not threatened with flooding, but locals know the river is running high. And right now, it's way up compared to what it normally is at this time of year. Further north in Hannibal, the river is posing a risk of flooding. That's why crews installed the town's five flood walls on Tuesday. Yeah, we follow the guidance from the Corps of Engineers and then the uh, National Weather Service on what the river is doing. And then, you know, when we hit those guidelines, we put the gates in as we're directed. Downriver in Clarksville, volunteers spent the afternoon putting in place concrete barriers and building a rock wall. Thursday, they'll start filling sandbags. Mayor Joanne Smiley said their anxiety went up when they heard the river would crest at 31 feet 7 inches. And when it hit 31.7, um, things really began to get in gear because we know that's when the water begins to come into the park, over the railroad, and into the city. The town of Winfield is expecting the river to crest over the weekend in the moderate flood stage, but the town's levees will keep the water from causing any damage. So while the rising river not expected to impact Celebrate St. Louis, the Coast Guard is recommending that those towboat drivers that are pushing barges up the river maybe use two pilots, one to navigate, the one to pilot the boat, the other one to be looking for that debris. There's a lot of it in the river right now. Live in Kimswick, Russell Kinsall, First Alert 4.